Possibilities with the Gemini moon today, which is going to grab you? Red Robe Astrology for April 12th. We're still in the mode of receiving important information from Mercury's inferior conjunction. All Mercury and solar transits influence about three days worth. So be looking for those messages. The planets are now quiet for a couple of days until Monday when the retrograding Mercury is going to conjunct Chiron and the healing continues. Meanwhile, quiet stretches are just reverberations with whatever's in our past. Um, so quiet days are not quiet at all. And the moon in Mercury means it's all about communication. And with Mercury retrograde, <laughs> that could be problematic, especially in a day where there's really two possibilities. There are sextiles to Sun, North Node, and Mercury. That's very positive energy. Sextiles are potential. You put some effort in, you get a lot out. A sextile to the North Node means cooperation with others. One to the Sun means good balance, inner and outer, with our inner experience and outer experience. And a sextile to Mercury means the best communication possible, considering that Mercury is retrograde. Meanwhile, the moon is also squaring Mars and Saturn. That's a totally different kind of energy. That's delays, breakdowns, fights, arguments. Um, and now, those lunar aspects, the difficult ones, are early in the day. They hit between like 6 and 9 a.m. Pacific time. So the difficulty is front-loaded. Now, the lovely energy comes later, but they are sextiles. They are only potential energies. If you get stuck in perceiving the day as shitty during the squares, then you're not going to be able to enjoy the flow that's possible when you need to put a little effort in. So watch what you're perceiving and what you're focusing on. Focus on the things that are difficult. They get more difficult. Focus on solutions, and the solutions will come. It's that sort of day. Have at it.